guys, you might. This is the. I was just packing up, um, just sorting everything out, ready to go back in the uh, in the house, and um, I nearly forgot. You said I'll just do a quick video. Here's the buckle I'm on about, mate. It's solid stainless, quite FD. Um, it's my boy, one of my idols, to be honest, um, Al Stallman. It's the Al Stallman brand. Um, which without him to be honest in my opinion is one of the best leather smiths in the world well he was um, you know if it wasn't for him I don't think leather would be where it is um, leather uh, smiths would be where they are today without him so he's been an inspiration to a lot of leather smiths over the years me included um, so uh, but other than that the re you know it's it's solid stainless I'm, you know the nickels of nickel ones are great you know and I do use them um, depending on what it's for but I think for a for a custom belt you should either have solid stainless or solid brass um, to me it's important you know if you're paying good money for a belt you, you, you have good hardware it's, it's that simple anyway so that's the uh, the buckle I was on about hope you like that um, if not we can come to some other arrangement I think it's beautiful I love the way it tapers out it'd be very pretty um, if that's what you're, uh, you know, uh, if not, I could, I've got plenty of um, solid brass ones up there, uh, no, no problem. As for colours, this is a kind of saddle tan, this is antique, so um, you can have saddle tan, dark brown, medium brown because I only use the professional all doors. What, what I'd say to you is, bud, if you go on to any of the fibings sites or feebings um, whichever way you want to pronounce it and you look at their colour chart I mean it does differ when you put it on the lever a little bit but not massive amounts um, and there aren't many of them I haven't got to be honest unless you went for something mad like yellow <laughs> um, other than that I've, I've got pretty much um, everything else covered you know uh, so yeah um, Size, I suppose, is uh, one and a half inch. It's a, it's a standard for the belt, unless you want something different. Um, if it's going to be for dress wear, you know, on your jeans and stuff, I'd recommend one and a half inches. Um, it's just about perfect. Um, if you, if you, you know, even the outside of your clothes, if with the bushcraft and stuff, if you do that, then you know, um, one and a half inch is great. One and three quarters. S some people have two inch, but you know, that's it's, it's, it's too big for me. Um, but other than that, bud. Um, as for stitching uh, colours, you can have black, Havana, dark brown, yellow, red, white, orange, um, I don't know what else I've got in. There aren't many with a, with, with, with a colour of stitching. Um, I, I hope this helps a little bit, bud. Um, I know it's only a quick little one. Um, I wanted to show you the book and I said I'd do this and I have, I'll try and stick to what I can do also while I'm here guys um, I'd, I'd like to give a big thank you to uh, Roman Legionnaire for his shout out um, all the new subscriptions I've got the last couple of days has been uh, phenomenal, Th thank you so much um, it's really really appreciated um, no doubt some of it's uh, due to you uh, Roman um, but uh, and, and probably my good mate um, Andy um, but uh, either way, you know, it's it, it's great and uh, a, a real thank you for that. Um, th thank you very much. Uh, so other than that, bud, uh, you know, I won't go over you with, uh, you know, if you contact me regarding length and stuff like that, you know, uh, your size waist and stuff, we can go from there with that. But other than that, hope this helps a little bit um, and sort of gives you a, I mean, you could have like a, you know, um, I could tool it all for you if you wanted a certain thing tooled on it. I mean, but you're looking at, a, 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 you know, it, 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 it'd be a different price for a rather than a bog standard one. I mean, I could do whatever you need for it, to be honest. Um, I could tool whatever ever you want on it. I could, um, I mean, as for the basket weave type of stuff, um, you know, it's a little bit time consuming, but not as bad as if you asked me to tool or, like I've done my belt like this, um, if you ask me to tool a different pattern on, um, you know, that's, that, that is real time consuming, so um, obviously the point, price should reflect that. I mean, if you wanted a basket weave one done, I mean, I bash these out 
fairly quick. It's not nowhere near as time consuming as something like something like that. Um, but other than that, I'll, I'll leave it there and uh, hopefully I'll get this up tonight for you, I hope. I'm shattered, it's about half past five now, I think, or quarter to six. I'm still down here, I'm supposed to be going in and doing the knives, but uh, I'm shattered today. This flu's beat me up, so I'm going to have to leave the knives tonight. Because otherwise it'll be another half past eleven -er and, you know, I'm back up again at half past seven. Anyway, guys, um, take care. I hope that helps, Cozy. Uh, bye for now, Lee.